Hello, welcome back. Last time the water zone offered me an opportunity to switch to the sewer zone and I took it immediately. And, uh... I'm still there right, I'm speedy. And I've gotten used to that, sort of. I'm gonna go to Marshlands of Death. And there's stuff to do there. I've cleaned my inventory more or less right. I have toggle between water and not water. I want to do a thing while I'm close to home. I have another Zarchton Harpoon there and I could make things a little more convenient for myself by putting it in the hands of one of my two empty-handed melee users. So that's the legionary spear, isn't it? Which is less good than the Zarchton Harpoon. Both are light two-handed weapons. I mean, maybe this is fine? So in your hands, how do these compare? I mean, legionary's worse. Wait, hold on. Well, those are about the same between the two of these, actually, surprisingly. I would think your light weapon skill would boost that more. Anyway, so this is here, in case I want it. And somewhere in here is another Zarchton Harpoon. I'm gonna try and find it. There's one. Is there another one in there? Okay, so you can have one... Or Para can have one. I don't happen to have a third, do I? I think there's one for sale, but I haven't bought it. Nah, if I had a third, I would have picked it up by now, probably. Unless, what's this? A tribal spear? Uh, even less impressive than the legionary. Okay, well, I mean, it's uh, a little less to do. Yeah, so I'll put that in the hands of... Oh, no, actually, you're higher damage dealer than... Okay, that's fine. Somehow I figured the light weapons user would be better, but no, the one with strength would do better than the one with dexterity. Even if the one with strength has heavy weapon skill and the one with dexterity has light weapon skill, I guess. The strength is just that much stronger. Okay, so, uh, a little bit of convenience there. If I get a third one, yeah, I can just not have to bother with the, the shuffle that I do. But the shuffle is fine. It's functional. It's not the best, but it's good enough. This is not the way. This is really not the way. Here is where I want to be. I forgot which pool of water I was in. Um, while I'm here, actually, I'm going to do a second distraction since I'm like right next to this thing. With this horn I've been carrying around for a long time. Shoot, I need to go shopping. Right, I need lockpicks and pickaxes. I have lockpicks. I need pickaxes. There may be more to mine. There is more to mine there, and I'm out. Okay, what happens in this tower? I put this. It mines, creates a rock slide. I step on that. Also, this is where the... Oh, right, there are uh, those to fight. At my current level, they're actually not too bad. Yeah, I'm getting chomped on a lot. Some of my blood was drained, but I have plenty left. Okay. Boy, that's a dangerous spot right there. I'm gonna have to click... <laughs> ah, don't like that. But it's just how it is. Alright, so, got a power gem. That's nice. What is this? The back end of a torch bracket or something? Something. Alright, power gem. Alright, so earth essence. Uh, let's make that uh, one of these. Okay, yeah, so I've been carrying around that horn for a while, meaning to do something like that with it. I assume this plate just opened up the insects over there. Maybe one was for each. No, this tells me the sound. This opens up the... the, uh, the zones. Okay. Alright, so I was saying I really could use a couple of more pickaxes. Alright, so that suspicion... This suspicion can't see anything. Okay. Great. Yeah, I mean, since I'm right here, I should shop now. Because, yeah, wasn't there at least one wall I needed to break and I didn't have the tools? So let's get the tools. Storm City is just right here. Yes. Yeah, okay, I guess this place just looks that much different to me at night. Like, this is what I expect to see. I just somehow never managed to come here during the day. You sell the things I want, right? You sure do. What? 
Underwater fights, right, yeah. Well, you say that. I I didn't bring money. That's fine, it's just right over here. I'll buy three. I suppose that'll probably be enough for now. My box full of these things is full. Mm-hmm. Alright, well, another torch goes on the floor then. Chomp. Egg is out. This is the one I want, I think. You get to chomp on a fish or something. I don't have any. Alright, listen on a stick then. You're fine, you're fine. Okay. Pickaxe, one blue gem. Alright, here we go. So with that ready to go... I think I can resume what I was doing. Was there anything else I needed? That was what I remembered. There might be other things too, though. I'll find out when I get there. Alright, so down here... Um, there, there's a burrow rat shank on the ground, and there was one in a place where I stepped and I did not notice until later. It was in, like, along a, a place that looks like this. So I'm just gonna walk a little bit and see if I can locate that thing. It's a minor thing, but it was something I did not pick up. Whoops. Uh, okay, so where am I actually going? Closed underwater. Ladder is a thing that I can... Um, right, there's a boss fight. Mine here. Okay, that's what I'm currently doing. Boss fight will happen shortly. Slimes are there. This is one of my rocks. It's not doing anything, actually. Where was I mining? Here. This is closed, so I have to go around the other way? Wait. How did I ever get there? What's this pool of water I'm in? Right, and there's a spike trap down there that I've disarmed with a rock, it looks like. Something like that. Uh, what am I trying to do? I placed a torch there, it opened the thing. Sure, I remember that part. This goes nowhere. The thing I'm looking for is like somewhere along here, probably. But now, how do I get... This is open, that's how. Okay. Alright, so with me here... Mineable spot is there. Yeah. That is so loud. Alright, big square room with these thingies in it. Alright, so we're gonna do some sort of pushing puzzle here. There was one of those that seemed unresolvable in the marshlands above. Also, there are slimes in the wall here. I can see their glow. So that's the kind of activity we're gonna do once this gets started, it looks like. Alright, well, here, here's some rot. You want some rot? Too bad, you're eating it anyway. Alright, so something's gonna happen with slimes. How do I get this party started? Like, I need the floor to activate, I think. Okay, and I guess maybe I need to do something elsewhere, or here. Okay, that helped. Slimes are here, All right? Now these were unfreezable, I thought. Not seeing anything that tells me otherwise. Oh, I was gonna switch your axe, that's right. I had another weapon I preferred. All right, well, I'm not at home right now, so that's not happening. Beef, you've set on fire since you can't be set on ice. You have a lot of health. This is a very durable slime. Not too much of a threat in this combat situation. But yeah, like, look at that cooldown. That is... It gets very hot with use. I'm trying to backstab you as if you have one of those, but you do not. There was at least one more. I see at least one more. Also, there's a lever. Okay, that looks to be a reset. 
good. Oops. Ah, I missed. You stepped into my space, so my, my move didn't move. No, so I poisoned a slime once. Maybe I just thought they were immune because they were green. Can I poison you with um with this? Yeah, okay. They, at least these slimes take poison normally. Do slimes usually take earth damage? Somehow I thought they liked it. Maybe not. Anyway, these freeze immune ones at the very least do take earth damage. Let's try Moonblade special attack. Yeah, that's just as underwhelming as I thought. Like, it's fine, it's just it takes too long to come out is the problem. Hey, check it out, level ups. That's nice. So these two are ahead. These two are sort of catching up. Right, so I'm watching those bars. When they equalize, I'll do a, a thing. All right, you. Looks like you were getting light weapons five. Sounds fairly reasonable. What else would I do? More critical would be fine, but I choose light weapons. You want damage. And this means you can now, if I wish... No, you still can't do that. Right, no, that takes Ogre's Grip, or whatever it's called. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Alright, whatever, doesn't matter. You were working on a lot of things. Of those things, which am I most interested in? I guess resist shock? Yeah, that sounds reasonable. Okay. And also, your lightning bolt is stronger. Now, how do I cast that? Like this, I think? Yeah. Alright. So, I did that. Uh, this looks to be open. Right, that was a slime passage. No longer occupied. Alright, so this is a puzzle with a failure condition. Sort of. Uh, a puzzle that can be failed since it has a reset. I feel like some of the ones that didn't have a reset also could, but I don't know that. Alright, so this is a big messy board. Yeah, no one can go here. Am I going to learn to chop down a tree? Because I think there were also trees in the way... Do I know how to chop down a tree now? Perhaps I put a firebomb on it. Or like... At its base? There is no putting anything at the base. Like that's where the rotten pit bread was, but I can't do that. Hmm. First of all, let's try a fireball. That doesn't do it. Let's try a fire bomb. That doesn't do it. Mm, let's try a big axe chop. No. Let's try other bombs. Can't freeze it. Can't zap it. Can't poison it. Like, everything I'm seeing here, including what's up above in the marsh, is telling me there's a way to destroy these trees. Is there a particular angle to it? Mm. If I'm stood there, I can throw that. Is there anything else I have that might interact with this tree? I mean, these don't go just, like, go through these fences. Oh, they do. Oh, well that explains the m <laughs> Okay, I guess that's what's going on. So instead of what would seem to be the obvious answer of chop down the tree, there's a much less obvious answer of there's a super jank interaction that like these two things just don't collide with each other. Do these objects not exist together with- Oh, uh, these probably exist together in Isle of Nex, but maybe not with blue on both sides of them. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Fine. So I can probably do that thing up above, too. Okay, so... I mean, that has interesting traversal implications. In that that can move and I can't. It's the opposite of a block barrier. That is not where I wanted to put that. Or maybe it is just for stashing for a moment. Okay, so my targets are here, there, and there. So those three corners. 
This one must approach from this way. That looks pretty clear of everything else. So I kind of feel like there's not a lot that can go wrong at this point. So I'm trying to approach you from here. There we go, that's... Whoa. Separate thingies, got it, okay. So you're on your target, you need to go that way twice, easy. And you need to go... Somewhere that's a little less easy, maybe. Okay, first of all... This away. Then here. Then here. Then here. Again. And then here. Alright. Cool. I bought lots of lockpicks, so I should be good on those for a while. And this chest is not even locked. Completely unsecured. Oh, and also has given me lockpicks. Opening this chest increased my number. Rogue gloves, I like those. Yeah. Uh, I do like being able to carry things. You're wearing plate gauntlets? Are you kidding me? No wonder you're overloaded. Okay. I must have put those on for the uh, four-way attack fight and forgotten about them. So those will go in the pile with that stuff back at home. Alright. So this is all resolved, right? Including that. Great. And with knowledge gained, I want to go back up above and do something about that. However... Okay, yeah, so this had no response to items. I'm sure I tried it. Here's another rat shank I have not stepped next to. Well, I'm here, though. Um, I want to go back up above. And that's close. Okay, that's happening first. Uh, to do this, I do that. So way over, kind of on the other side of the marsh. Here-ish. Yeah, I got tree problems there. Okay, so to get there... Uh, that doesn't look like it goes. There's a wall in that spot. So... Let's try this first. Then I think I'm going to go north of here. Yeah, other way doesn't do it. An ogre charged me from there, I remember. Long ago. This was Pat's Castle Courtyard, that's right. And I am supposed to have a uh, amulet of crystal before going there. Right, haven't been there yet. Maybe through Rattling Boss Zone. Alright, so, this weird thingy. The, right, the issue was these fences. I thought the issue was the trees. Now, some of these are unpowered. So those are going to have to power up for this situation to resolve. That's a pressure plate. Okay. I uh, don't know what that means. Now, hold on. No, this cannot move... At all. You're cornered forever. But someone else could maybe move into that spot? Okay, how many targets are there? Is it just the one? If it's just the one... Uh, then yes, I have an approach here, except this is off. That's off, that's off. No, I think this is... I just don't have a way to do it. Is there a reset thingy somewhere? Hmm. Also, what was with these little pools of poison? Right, there are pressure plates in them that... Uh, may, like, summon poison here. There's nothing of particular interest down there. 
Why does this exist? I don't think there ever were items there. And like, these don't respond to rocks, do they? No? Hey look, I found a rock in this one! There we go. I, I do not get this. Uh... Yeah, so not just to its north, like there's other problems here too. Is there a reset to this just like hidden among the right? I stepped in here, therefore it's nighttime forever. There's that pressure plate that I don't know what it ever did, if anything. Okay. Oh, you can move. Here we go. I did something at least. Maybe that can make it. Uh, maybe? Yes. Okay, and the rest is just like... noise, I guess? Second moon blade? That's interesting. How does that compare to the fist dagger? Favorably if I don't want to do the big stab, which I guess I'm not doing most of the time, so... sure. That's acceptable. Ah, uh, you're carrying too much now. Because you took off those strong gloves. Okay, well, I don't really want you, like, right on the cusp of overloaded. I guess I should do some of this. And put those back at home. I can. Sure. I feel like there's more I should do somehow. Like, what are you carrying that's... so too much? I mean, there's this... Your equipment mostly looks okay. You're not, like, wearing any heavy armor by surprise. I guess I'll just put those thingies away and hope that, uh... Hope that helps. Okay, and this... there's just like nothing really close to this. Like this whole line just is disconnected from everything else. But I can jump in there. That's a shortcut back. Okay. So somewhere here... why is there a force field there? Oh, there's a chest in it. Reach out deep inside the skull nose of death. Hmm. That's what it says. <laughs> and that's all I know. Don't know what that means. You here. By the way, I have a potion of dexterity for whoever wants such a thing. If I go by Resist Shock, Conran wants it the most, and that's acceptable. If I go by Dodge, Evasion, um, Yurak wanted it more, but she got the last one. So this goes in my pile of heavy armors, which was here. Right, that's relevant. All these things rebalance so you can be slightly less loaded. Sure, that's all fine. I guess I'll just leave this at home. I mean, I like it, but the two moon blades, the numbers are better. Unless I want to do a big stab, which sometimes I do. Ah, just complicating things. What did I just push? That. Carry. How heavy are these? A little bit. I'm kind of not really using them. Alright, well... Every little bit helps, I suppose. Sure. And I guess if I'm doing this, I should do that. Alright, well, this looks about as good as it's gonna get. So, back to sewers. Time for a boss fight. Uh, this is the right way, yes. 
Let's see how reasonable that is. Rattling boss, let's see, has a big cannon. Cannon hurts, don't get blasted. And other than that, right, so he turns very fast. But if I just watch his movements carefully, I should be able to avoid such a fate. What's with this? Oh, right, I've been both sides. So I just don't, that's not something to concern myself with. Light expiring. I go this way to climb there, to go this way, to go there. Yep, that's the one. So you. Let's fight. Oh, is there a discontinuity? Oh, this is a ranged fight. So we got gunner, possibly knifer, and cannoner. Master of the sewers. Okay, but also there are dudes close to me. Oh, this is gonna be weird. Oh, this is gonna be super weird. And also mosquitoes exist for some reason. Um, I'm getting shot by so many guns. None of them cannon, I think, though. So I forgot, again, to s switch my, my weapon with the, uh, the one I want to switch. Alright, well, I'm getting shot a lot, but no injuries are happening, so I'm not getting hit very hard. That's nice. Oops. Alright, where's Cannoner? Not close to me. I don't think he knows about me. So second mosquito swarm has come. They're not too bad. Okay, so and those are those dudes are totally unaware of me. Mosquitoes will continue coming. I am not in ranged weapon mode, so let's change that. That is fine. I can take my time. Oh, I just put away some arrows. Whoops. It's fine. Okay, so could you... Ah! Unfortunate. Where is your weapon? Why? Oh, I, I see what I did. Uh, and with you too, I messed up. Oh boy. Yep, this is the perfect time for this. Cannon man is bearing down on me like that. It's fine, don't worry about it. Roar, yep, you know about me now. Alright, so that means you're going to actively try and shoot me. Which is concerning. So I need to watch out. Now you, you, you turn very fast. I don't know if you can turn to 180. You might be able to. Now I assume there's some way to switch sides here. And, well, I have to get back my ranged weapons at some point. Farzam is the fly swatter. Here, let's try... let's see how this works. Should be as good as my other two main magic schools. Okay, so you're down, that's great. Let's try this one. Ah! Ah! Whoa! Danger! There's one of my axes, it went in the mosquito swarm, and they carried it around somehow. You are not shooting that cannon. Well, I'm kind of trying not to give you the opportunity, and I guess I'm succeeding. Whoa. Oops, I missed. Here we go. Oops. Well, I did run out of arrows. Whoops. Oh, you. Be set on fire or something? Alright, well, out of arrows. That's fine. You're roaring at me again. 
My fly swatter's kind of tired. Here, have a couple of those. Alright, so how do I... Ouch! Okay, well there went the cannon. No injuries happened, which is nice. I don't know how I'm ever getting over there. Oh boy, alright, so how am I doing this? You dodged somehow. Alright, let's have poison happen. Oops. Oh, sure. That worked. Alright, you go away. Yes, that's good. I could snag some of those. Alright, so spikes go off. Ah, I didn't snag well, but that can totally work. Man, I am just not doing this right. There. That's one. <laughs> I mean, it's something. Snort, snort, snort. Can I get more? I can get the arrow, in theory, if I could ever figure out how to aim at it. It's lower than I think, but not that low. Ouch. Okay, you are in danger. I'm gonna... Okay, so next time mosquitoes appear, I'm going to swat them, then put a force field in front of me and take a rest. And hope Yurak doesn't die before swatting happens. Uh, she might? Okay. Force field in front. Take a nap. Ouch. Okay. That worked out. Hunger is happening. This is a weird fight. Uh, sure. Alright, so, anyway. Working on you. I don't know how much more of my ranged weapons I can reclaim. I might have to finish this with magic. Which does not go very fast, especially when I miss all the time. Here we go, an arrow. Can I charge this? No. Uh, you quit that. Almost there. Here, poison is probably my best bet since I'm landing blows so infrequently. Still got some shurikens left. Hey, one more little hit should do it. There we go. Okay. Cool. Good encounter. I uh, sure have that. It's pretty small. You have one too. All right. So here's another big boomstick, if you want a second one. Okay. I didn't count up my munitions before coming here, but I should get them all back without needing to do that. Alright, so, so putting away the arrows, I did that at the worst time. I will get more, and, uh, oh boy. Why am I making you carry this? Um, because your load is actually pretty light. Tome of Health goes to whoever's lowest, which is you. That's a nice, simple way to decide. I don't have to think about it. I can just look. I have a lot of gold keys. Enough that my bag is overflowing. So, if there's something I ever wanted with a gold key, I should consider getting it now-ish. Currently, I don't know of anything in particular. But I'll check and see if... Uh, there was anything? Like, I guess mostly I'd sh shop around at home. There's also that shop on the beach. Uh, anyway, so that's done. Did that accomplish anything other than giving me some items? Like in terms of unlocking things around here? I am not sure. So like, that's already done. This is possibly another boss fight, some sort of encounter. Where's that thing I saw once? Sorry, that thing I didn't see. But now I know how to. There it is. You. Hidden on the ground. Chomp. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, so there's this big tangle about, like, all this stuff that, uh... I don't have the means to do anything about right now as far as I know. What did this do? It made that appear, I think? So I guess I'm just hoping that one of... Um... Well, I guess at this point this thing helps me out up here? Maybe it will. That's the main thing I haven't done down here. Alright, cool. 718 sounds plausible. Alright, well let me just park myself next to this thing. I don't think I need to go refuel before I mess with that. Where is it exactly? Right here. Okay, so whatever you are next time. I'll see you then.